Hello and welcome to the M7 Innovation Brief. I'm your host, Matt Marr, and you know the deal. Media Tech Innovation, 90 seconds, let's go. Google is having a bad couple of months. The tech giant was just hit with its fifth antitrust lawsuit since 2020, and this one may have some teeth. The DOJ, alongside eight states, are suing Google for its conflict of interest in advertising, playing both buyer and seller. The common analogy is if Goldman Sachs owned the New York Stock Exchange. But the reality is the FTC should have never allowed Google's acquisition of DoubleClick back in 2007, but tech was too cool and confusing to be scrutinized. Now you see the result of 15 years of unregulated siloed evolution with a grow at all cost mentality. Does this lawsuit have teeth? Well, it was filed by Biden's new antitrust division. And if I guess the political strategy, you don't pick the antitrust lawsuit that is the most important to solve, you pick the one you think you can win. Niantic, the maker of Pokemon Go, may be saying game over if their newest title doesn't work. Niantic is hoping NBA All World will be the new mega hit that creates an entirely new genre of sports games. Since the craze of Pokemon Go, it's been rough. Harry Potter Wizards Unite had unbelievable IP, but just didn't work. Pikmin Bloom was fun and creative, but no commercial success. This NBA game seems smart. Popular sport, engaged community, interaction with pro athletes via augmented reality in real life locations. But the technology is still limiting. Yes, I'd love to get my ankles broken by a virtual Steph Curry at my local court, but I'm still experiencing that all through a five inch screen. Not great. Amazon may be exploring NFTs. Rumors are swirling that Amazon is planning to launch an NFT initiative in spring 2023. Amazon will test and learn on just about anything, so it's not a shock that they'll test out NFTs. We've discussed how NFTs are directionally correct. They can provide utility, access, and tear out loyalty, but something about Amazon building its NFT strategy in-house makes me think it'll be very sterile and corporate. We won't judge until it's real, it's just our hunch. Well, that's all the time that we have for the M7 Innovation Brief. Thank you for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you next week.